That's from John 4, 23, 24. Just in case. If you don't read your Bible, we can talk about it later. Um, and the other scripture is based from Romans chapter 8, verse 14, that says that many as led by the Spirit of God, may are the sons of God. Amen. Um, but as my brother Richard told you, well, my name's Lily. My name's Lily. Um, by the way. Hi. Um, so what we believe, we're a group of worshippers. Um, our chosen form of expression is music and the arts. Um, but we believe that worship is, is not limited to the song you sing, the dance that you do, the painting that you draw, or whatever else it is that you do in any capacity. Worship is the life that you live. Amen. It is, it is everything that you do when you wake up in the morning, when you roll out of bed, everything that is directed towards God, everything that is centered around God, and ultimately it has to be received by Him for it to be worship. Amen. So we're all about doing that, living that life, and inspiring other people also to live that life. So spirit led worshipers, you're all spirit led worshipers. Yes. Because you ought to be able to go to your workplace and inspire somebody to worship God. And that's the culture that we're, we're, we're trying to foster. And, you know, that's what we're about. Amen. So worshiping God and inspiring others to do the same. Amen. Hey, everybody. Um, my name is Samuel. Hi, I'm literally just kind of carrying on from what Lyle said. Um, in SLW, we have a culture. And the culture of worship is one which is birthed out of the true revelation of who God is. So, when you see God, and you see God from a personal perspective, and he, he touches your heart so much that you establish an altar in your secret place, you will find out that in the corporate place, your place of worship becomes divine in the world. So this worship gathering is simply a place where we have come to give to God on his terms. We have come with a structure knowing that the whole structure will change. If God wants us to sing one song for hours, we will sing one song for hours. Yes, if God wants us to dance, to sing, to cry, to cry out, then we will ensure that our worship to God simply and truly reflects who He is to us. So that's spirit and worship. We have spirit that dances, we have spirit that media, just ensuring that everything that we do is a true reflection of who God is to us. We believe in a level of excellence which can only be achieved in His presence. And this is why we are here. Not for performance, not for anything that we believe, not by our terms, not by our structure.